Before our new impact assessment system, we had several surveys across all of our overseas projects, and although they gave us lots of paper, we didn't really get much measurable data. It was hard to see the impact we were having fighting against disease, poverty and prejudice, even though we knew there was one. So we decided to make a change that would help us transform more lives. Working with our overseas staff, we started to use mobile technology with standardized questionnaires to collect data on the people we were helping. We then used business intelligence software to compare and contrast that data across all of our projects in India, Bangladesh and Mozambique. We were the first to use mobile technology to tackle leprosy and it's really working. We are gathering never before seen information about those people living with neglected diseases like leprosy. For example, we can now find out how many days of work some people have to miss because of the disease and identify specific areas where misdiagnosis of leprosy is high. With real-time tracking, we can see the data as it comes in and from that information, we can then tailor our projects to target the problems, whether that means training more doctors on the signs of leprosy or working with individuals to fight for their disability rights. This new data is shaping the way we work allowing us to identify the need and help more people. As of October 2016, 2,600 children, women and men had been included in our new system and already benefited from the improved projects. That's not counting our staff across three countries who can now share the data and learn from each other. They can access any data set from any project and can create infographics to share the information with others so that all staff can benefit from the data collection. This new information is giving us unbelievable insight into disease, poverty and prejudice and allowing us to fight these global issues more specifically. By 2020, we want all of the new people we meet to be registered in our system and for the software to be used in all of our projects. Our impact assessment shows that any small charity working with just one monitoring and evaluation officer and some enthusiastic staff members can set up a transparent data and analysis system which really can change lives.